And more often than not, it becomes more spiritual than it should be practical. You saw the woman praying there. Well, that are uh, some of the emotions the NSMQ brings. And this morning, I'm privileged to have the managing director of Primetime, the production house, who are, I mean, actually seeing to this in the presence of Nanakia Ankoma Asari and the quiz mistress herself. Nanakia, welcome. Thank you. And Prof, once again, congratulations on your EMY award. Thank you very much. Yeah, I saw, I saw the surprise that, and the way you're humbled with your speech. I loved it. <laughs> yes, I was overwhelmed. <laughs> I didn't know what to say. You weren't honestly. expecting it? Well, I expected it, but uh, it's still different when you're actually up there. Okay. Well, you've put in good work. Thank you, sir. So what is taking us back to Kumasi? <laughs> <laughs> is that for the love that, Charlie, it is always, uh, it brings some refreshing moments to travel all the way to Kumasi and have all the students there. Uh, I'm just because last year we were in Kumasi and this year we are going yes. to Kumasi. Yes. Well, a combination of factors. Okay. Um, our, our regular place has been Ligon, and, um, but Ligon is not in session. Okay. But we had a really good time when we went to Kumasi last year, and we, we thought that we would go back again. It, it gave a different feel to the, the competition, and um, we loved it. Mm. <laughs> Even the semi-final. <laughs> ah. ah. That Kumasi derby was like the finals itself. The, the enthusiasm was was really great and, and, and we are happy to go back. Well, it's always said that the semifinals are way, 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 way tense than the finals themselves. But how are yes. preparations towards this? Well, preparations this are going well. Mm -hmm. we are, we're doing all the things that need to be done, reforming the schools, uh, the consultants are getting their questions ready. Everybody's doing what they need to do to get the program to come off. Yeah. Prof, I kind of feel you bring to to the NSMQ when you're asking your questions. My producer is asking me to ask you certain questions. H raised to the power 12 <laughs> divided by three, <laughs> finding the hypothesis. Of <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's like, amazing. <laughs> <laughs> there are times you don't even finish your questions and then you hear the bell go off. Yes. Of all the years that you've been with the NSMQ, what are some of the things Eat you're getting from these students who have been participating there? Well, the quiz is a very important thing to many schools mm -hmm. and many students. Okay. Uh, some of the students prepare even before they get to senior high school. Okay. In the basic schools, yes, junior high school, they are already wow. thinking of which school to apply to so that they can be on the quiz team. So they start preparations much earlier than we think. They work really hard. Mm -hmm. They are very excited about the program and they do everything possible. And so that's what's going to happen. They keep getting better all the time because the preparation keeps getting better and better. Well, it means that this is actually bringing some discipline and even competition amongst the students themselves. They be in their own competition yes. to be able to get better. Yes. And yes. that is good. Yes. I mean, if from basic school they are actually eyeing this mm -hmm. and working towards it, then mm -hmm. that should be good. Yes. And uh, uh, the little bird also told me that some schools are actually building their science department based on this. Yes, some schools have said so, that they built it from the National Science and Maths quiz. And, and selection, selection to be on the team is highly competitive because mm. every school wants to put their best foot forward. So it's highly competitive. They have all sorts of, uh, uh, should I say, perks mm -hmm. uh, if you're on the team. In some schools, you don't do housework. Uh, you're, uh -huh. You have a special diet. Yeah, yeah. Believe you me. <laughs> you I sleep have, in a special place. Don't worry. I have seen, I have seen <laughs> back in Infant Spim, right. I saw the team right. well being treated specially, being treated, being given preferential treatment because oh, they you are were representing. On the team? No, I wasn't on the team. No, I wasn't on the team. Okay. But I saw some of my right. friends who were on okay. the team being given preferential treatment. Yes. When we go to the dining hall, they sit here. Oh, at Saturday inspection time, they are, oh, they have to go and learn. So, yes, you feel very <laughs> important. And it, it, it was nice. But talking about the prelims, I know that has always been in the regions. Is that going to be the same? 
in actual fact, the, the change to the prelims in the regions was a reaction to COVID-19. Okay. Um, we needed to reduce the number of, of people in camp. Um, at the national level, we have 135 schools coming and we cater for five, five people per team. Mm. So that already is almost 700 people. And then they come with supporters. So we needed to, to cut down on the number of schools coming into, into, into camp mm. and the number of people because, you know, COVID was, uh, was very difficult to, to, to manage. And yeah. the more people you had uh, in the same place, the, the, la the bigger the, the, the chance that um, there was going to be some infection and trouble in camp. So we went around to the region so that we could break down the numbers into smaller uh, groups, more manageable okay. groups. And then we had the one eighth, from the one eighth to the finals in one place so that we would have uh, fewer schools coming there. At the prelims, we have 108 schools participating. At the one eighth, we have 81 schools. So it was just meant to, to manage the numbers. Um, this year, uh, we are doing much better in terms of COVID yes. you know, management and, and, and so we are going to have everybody come into camp like we used to. Mm. The schools that will be in the prelims will come in first and then the next week the schools that the seeded schools, the seeded schools will, will also join in just as we used to do in, in uh, the years before the COVID. Years before. Yes. Well with COVID still lurking around I want to be assured that safety of the students are up on high. Oh yes, okay. we, we take that very seriously. Okay. Um, we observe the COVID-19, you know, the established protocols, wearing of masks, disinfection of, of the hall and then the working spaces for the students and, 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 and a few other things. We will have the 24, we, we set up a 24 hour clinic oh, uh, that's in 2020, yes, mm. with a doctor in charge, in charge and nurses who are experienced with with COVID-19, so they could even identify uh, people, or, you know, participants who had the symptoms and then manage it. So we will have that on-site clinic. And then we have an arrangement with uh, the KNUSD uh, hospital so that um, any serious cases we have of any illness will be taken care of uh, immediately so oh, that's good yes. that's good yeah. prof now let me turn to you because you are you you are giving these students something to always go back to and also you you're actually how would i want to put this you're actually putting some some necessity and urge of wanting to be on this particular platform because of you the way you're you <laughs> you come about with your questions what is new this time this year Oh, nothing new. Nothing new. <laughs> same old, same old. <laughs> of course, uh, the consulting team is working very hard. Mm. Every year we bring different questions. Okay. Syllabus really hasn't changed much. I say this every year. Mm -hmm. We've been running this, this is 29 years. Yes. Science does not change that much. The foundation, at least, the ones that we look at. Mm -hmm. So every time we bring you a competition and you are still enjoying it, you are still thinking about how to answer the questions. Students are still being uh, encouraged to, uh, to think. You have to know that somebody has worked really hard mm. to make sure that they are changing around the questions in an interesting way, m being creative with the questions because the concepts really are still the same. That's mm. why I say no change. The concepts are still the same. It's still the same science concepts we know. But of course, uh, we are working on the questions to make them more interesting. As usual. And I, I like the balance. The, the change though, yes. is, is, is on the organization, organization. side. Okay, yes. so tell me about it. So um, we have two things that are, are new. Mm -hmm. uh, today is the launch. Yes, uh, later, on launch. Today. Yes. later on today. So yeah. we'll be launching, uh, uh, you know, the sick tune. Yeah. Every time you hear that. That, that, by Mozart. That, you, that is what you know actually that. brings the tension, especially when, believe you me, here in the office, right. almost every department comes to a standstill when we hear that because right. everybody wants to pay attention to it and see who is doing what. Right, mm -hmm. right. So, so um, we've taken a European uh, music and mm -hmm. brought it into Ghana, right. so we have localized it. So mm -hmm. today you're going to hear 
uh, a different version, a more localized version. Oh, okay. Of, of uh, the sick tune, Voiki Safiti, yes. And it's the, fir the first time yes, in the tour. The first time that you're hearing it. Localizing the sick tune. Localizing like the sick tune. <laughs> And then we have a few schools that we have invited over okay. to join in. They did exceptionally well at the, at the prelims, uh, at the regionals. Okay. Um, losing with 40 points and above. Uh, wow. Yes. 40 points and above. Yes. And one of that them, in fact, for, for us, the most, the most uh, remarkable one of them is Mankranso uh, Senior High School in the Ashanti region. This is their first time and they got 47 points. And, and over the years, we, when we did the prelims in the regions, we ended up having to take up a few extra schools to be able to make up the numbers for each region, to have enough schools in each of the contests for, for, for each region. And so when we looked at it, we felt that, you know, every year people talk about how some schools do really, really well but are unable to qualify. And um, because they don't win their contests. And in some of the regions, the contests are extremely competitive. And so we felt that uh, with the experience we'd, ha we'd had with uh, absorbing a few more schools um, during the regional prelims, we could make room for a few more. And so okay. there are um, nine schools okay. that did exceptionally well at the regionals. And so we've invited them to, to join in. And they're excited. We're excited too, mm -hmm. especially because of Mankar. So mm. 47 points at well, the regionals. Yes, and their first time. Up. I love the yes. fact that you're actually opening up to new schools so that they all get to have an experience of yes. this. Yes. Well, with the research and the question that you've been setting, <coughs> I, I, it's fairly balanced where between math, physics, biology, chemistry, and all that. Is that going to be the same, or are we going to be leaning towards a specific, I mean, area? We are not leaning towards a specific area. Yeah. It's okay. all It's going areas, to be even like that? Yes, all the areas we've been asking questions on mm -hmm. still Still going to be the same areas. Uh, yes. Still going to be the same, I mean, excitement uh, you ask the questions with. <laughs> yes. Well, my job really is to bring every single question to life. You do that very well. You bring <laughs> life in the questions. <laughs> and somehow, I, I, like, I like some of the students. They have the guts to yeah. actually yeah. face the questions. And yes. at times before you even finish a question, you hear the bell going off and I'm like, wow, this is really good. Yes. This is really great. Some, 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 some discipline is being instilled in these students to actually get closer to their books. Yes. Well, the thing is, you know, we don't use calculators. And so consultants have to make sure that the numbers can be managed. If you see enough questions from over the years, sometimes when the question starts, you can kind of predict which direction it would go to make the numbers work. And I wow. think the students are beginning to uh, study that in addition to studying the things they, should, they are supposed wow. to be studying. <laughs> My last question to you before we wrap up this. Uh, yes. The questions you ask, do you have do you know the answers without referring to the answers you're beginning yourself? Did I not go to senior high school? <laughs> oh, I know you did. <laughs> yes. You did. So I have been through senior high school. Well, those days it was called secondary school. Mm -hmm. I went on to sixth form. Mm -hmm. uh, I was a science student. I went to engineering school. Technically, I should be able to answer those questions, don't you think? So... But I'm not fast. My problem is I'm extremely slow. So, yes. Okay. If you give me enough time, I should be able to solve those so problems. The, all of them? Well, wow. the ones I'm not sure of, I'll go and study. How about the prime questions? The ones that actually you allot a lot of time. Because you know why I'm asking? It is interesting when you're putting life to the questions. Mm -hmm. So I, I try to understand if you can put life to the answers if you're giving the time <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course okay well ladies thank you so very much for having but um today is the launch, the launch exactly yes. when 
is it starting? No, the main, the championship itself. Oh, the championship. Yes. So we start on the 10th of October. Of October? Yes. That is just seven days from today. About, yes. Wow. So a week, yes. Mm -hmm. From today, we start with the prelims. Mm. Yes. Okay. And the final is on the 26th of uh, October. October. Yes. Mm. All the best. <laughs> all the best. You too. All the best. <laughs> I will do the, I'll do the viewing from the comfort of my office and in the homes. <laughs> well, can, to all, can I say, yeah, 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 can yes. I say something? Yes, uh, please do. I'd like to say a really big thank you to my sponsors. Okay. Uh, putting together something like this is, is very uh, capital intensive and we are really grateful to the, the Ministry of Education and the Ghana Education Service for for being the main sponsors, they're the main sponsors of, of the National Science and Math Quiz. And putting in all the resources that, that they can at mm. our disposal. I'd like to say a very big thank you to Absa Bank as well. Okay. Um, they're a, a partner sponsor. Okay. So we'd like to say a very big thank you to them, to Goyle, um, for the Goyle Rido Bonanza. Okay. Uh, Etel Tigo for the, uh, the highest score, score award to Prudential Life Insurance for the NSMQ star. I'd like to say thank you to, to um, GNPC, they are new. This is giving some scholarships okay. and a little support. Um, to Academic City University College and um, uh, Accra College of Medicine for their, their, their support and the scholarships that they will be giving out. Mm. Dano Milk. Okay. Uh, I'd like to say a really big thank you to our media, you know, partners, to Joy News, you know, leading the multimedia okay. train, um, YFM also for support. I want to say thank you to everybody who's who's um, helping us, uh, you know, Newmont. Okay. Prizes. Mm. There are also private individuals who have given prizes okay. over the years. We are grateful to everybody for, well, for this. Support. Well, well I'm, I'm, I'm very excited about Corporate Ghana, and I'm just hoping that we'll have a lot more of Corporate Ghana into the NSMQ. Well, the launch happens today, and the championship takes off on the 10th of October to the 29th, right? The 26th. To the 27th. That is where we're going to be seeing who actually comes up as the champions. I wonder if the de defending champions will still take it. Well, ladies, thank you so very much. You. And you see, and, well, well, someone is screaming Kumasi High School into my ears. I don't know about <laughs> that, but we, we live to see. They're doing well. They're doing, They're doing well, well right? They're doing well this okay. year. They're doing well. <laughs> well, Martin, you had it there. They're doing well this year. And also, we are coming to have a review on the kids in the kitchen. Yes, Big Chef Season 2 is ongoing, and some people are shedding tears because they're being evicted. And I'm not sure they're too excited about the judges, but... Uh, the emotional turnaround when we get to the kitchen with these kids is still on and rife here on Prime Morning. And we are going to be having the host, Michelle, join us shortly. <laughs>